Hi guys, Dave's here. Well, today I'm going to show you something here. I've been going through my garage, Doug, and I'm working on my old car, and I found some parts here that does not fit my car. I bought years ago. Sometimes you don't um, buy something that doesn't fit that you think it does. Well, I want to sell this, and I need to ship it, but I need a box long enough to ship it in. But I can't find one long enough. But we can take a box and make it longer. I'm going to show you an example with a smaller box here, and then I'll show you this in the bigger box. Okay, I'm going to show you on this box so it'll fit in the video better. But you know, this box here measures 18 inches long. So uh, you know, you, if you got something 18 inches long, you can fit it in there. Well, what about you got something just a little bit longer? It ain't going to fit. So what we're going to do here is we're going to mark this here in the middle. And if I measure across, this is 12 inches, so 6 inches. Then we're going to take either a utility knife or a pair of scissors and cut it here. You want to cut right down to the edge right here. That's as far as you want to go. Okay, it's, it's going to look like this right here. It flaps like that. We're going to do this on, on this side. Then we're going to flip it over and do the bottom side. Okay, when we get when we get to this point right here, we're going to fold our flaps out. Then we're going to bend our box like this right here. This will let us down, make an 18 inch long box into a 24 inch long box. So, you, you, you know, if you're looking for a box for whatever you're chipping, um, measure the length of the box and half of the width of the, um, the sides. And that's how long the box is going to be afterwards. Okay, this is a box I found. This is on. Uh, and it's uh, it's 35 and a half inches long, and it's about 24 inches wide. So I've got it folded now and everything. So my piece fits right in there. So I took a 35 and a half inch long box and made it a 48 inch long box. So I hope this helps you out if you want to ship something long. And as always, thanks for watching, guys.